Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to another episode of Space Engineers. So last time we built the grinding pit and it works pretty well except for every now and then something will bounce off and float away. But you know what? I don't care. <laughs> I don't care. I was going to try to build some fancy little um, containment thing for it but to be honest I just I don't think it's really worth it. All the hassle and effort to catch the couple little bits and bobs that float off into space. It's kind of annoying. Um, and it's not a big deal. I can just fly after it, fly after them and grab them myself. Now, what I have done, ladies and gentlemen, is, like I said, I have built a little tug ship. <laughs> it's a really ugly little cube of a thing. And you know what? I kind of love it. <laughs> <laughs> it's this, this cute little bub. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> I don't know why, but I get so much amusement out of it. But it's time to test some things. So, first thing first. I have discovered, um, whilst grinding down ships, uh, turrets are a bit of a pain in the ass. For some reason, turrets tend to block the grinders. I think cause, I think it's because they've got like a, a big, such a large hitbox, but no actual... Um, oops, I've already checked to see if you have ammo on you. You do. Uh, because they've got such a large hitbox, as you can see, the 3x3, like a large cargo grid, but the actual turret itself isn't that big. I think it plays havoc with the grinders. I don't know. So I found that I need to I need to manually grind all the, uh, all the, all the turrets off and stuff and things. Oh, and Robert, if you're listening, if you're watching, I added build vision to the server or whatever so that should allow you to find your air leaks um, f f a lot easier in the future <laughs> not so much useful to you now but it is what it is anyway so first thing we want to do today is I want to quickly test this thing just boom I want to make sure that little grindy man uh, t tugging man I think I, what I call this the tuggertron 5000 uh, I need to turn down. Nope, that's up. I want to turn down the gyros to 12% or 9%, whatever. Same difference. Um, let's go here. Now, I've turned the ship off because like, it makes it significantly. Oh, nope, I didn't want to whack it. Did I grab it? I think I've grabbed it. Okay, I've grabbed it. Alright, now turn the power back up. Alrighty. Yeah, yeah, I know, you're not happy, alright? Listen. Listen, Tuggertron. No. No. Why are you... Oh, I'm doing this wrong. Boom. There we go. We want to move it this way. This is like the most terrible <laughs> angle to do this. Can I zoom out? Yeah, that's actually a lot easier. Okay. Break! Alrighty. Now, you want to... No, no, no. What's with the delay? We don't want delays. Delays are bad when we're trying to maneuver large grid things. This may actually fit perfectly into this grinding pit. <laughs> this should be interesting. Oh, no. I know what's going to happen, though. Do, can you guys guess what's going to happen when I gr start grinding this down? I'll give you a hint. It involves these. It involves these two <laughs> pillar thingy, my bobs. I can tell you. I'll tell you exactly what's going to happen. They're going to separate, and then it's going to be a pain in the butt. Or what I can do is not use that block. That's not the right block. I want to use that block. Thanks. That. That. Bam. No. Yes. Okay. So that should allow them to stay connected longer. Are you on? You are on. Okay. Sweet. Okay, let's do this. <laughs> let's see how much of a terrible, terrible idea this is. Uh, can we get the angle? Okay, we need to go up a little bit, I think. Okay, yeah. And a little bit more. Uh, counter, counter the... There we go, and... Grind away! I say grind. Oh, I'm not even close to the ground. Okay, grind in a second. You can do it. You can do it. Grind away. 
Yeah. I think I'm going to call this just pretty successful. And I suppose the good thing about doing it with a ship like this, too, I should move over a little bit, is all the most of, a lot of the bits that are going to bounce away are going to hit the ship itself, which hopefully doesn't mean it's going to explode. But you know what? YOLO. You only grind once. Oh, look at this grinding pit. It's just devouring things. Look, I can probably just go... Uh, no, I can't go full burn. Bye bye little piece, I'll have to grind you down manually unfortunately, but in the meantime, ugh, <laughs> lots of little pieces. No, stop rotating. You know what would make this a lot easier? Infant future reference Smoky. If you, okay we can turn this down now. If I was to build this in the planetary gravity well, then I could just let the ship fall into it. That would make life so much easier. And then, you know, the bouncing objects probably wouldn't be an issue. Um, it is what it is, though. I've done what I've done. Okay, let's go this way. Eh. No, 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 don't no face plant. No! Why are you face planting? Bad. Bad little ship. There we go. Eh. Eh. Come on. It grind away. There we go. It's kind of easy to control in this one, but it's not as fun. I can't see it. Well, I suppose I can now because there's not much left. Okay, we don't want to get too close. No! <laughs> Whoa! Yeah, <laughs> turn the gyro all the way down. Okay, let's just let's grab this. Excuse me. Nope. You, you sir, do not get to escape. You must be ground all the way down. We need all the bits and bobs. But yeah, I think this little tugging boat works quite well. Now there is a, going to be a point in the future in which we will need a little grinding ship. Look at that. All nice and done. Not a single bit flew away. <laughs> Yeah, perfect. If I do say so myself. Alright, let's just land the little ship. Okay, and... Touchdown. Okay. Hop out. Perfect. Perfect, perfect. You can even... Watch this. If I go over here, right, I can even... No, not that. That's not what I'll do. I can retract it. <laughs> you know what? Since we can... Seeing as we can retract it, we can also technically... No, yeah, we'll do this one. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing, but I'm enjoying it. That's what's the point. I don't know what I'm doing, but I'm enjoying it. No, I want to go around you. Why is this a thing? <laughs> I'm pretty sure this doesn't have to be a thing where you hit this. But I, I don't know. That's, I'm not a mod person. Now we got to turn these grinder pits off. I only use these when no one else is online because I think they cause a bit of lag. Yeah, pretty sure they. I'm pretty sure they do. <laughs> so I only use them when uh, it's not around. Is that helicopter flying over above? That's interesting. But anyway, I'll call that a success. The last thing I'll do is I gotta get rid of this gold out, gold alkesh. Now, last time when I, we captured this, I was running around it took me longer than I care to admit to figure out that there was another cockpit on the front of the ship. Don't know why there is. Um, it just happens to be a thing. But anyway, I'm going to go grind this guy down and once we've done that, I'll come right back and we'll move on with today's episode. Uh, are you going to break? Are you slowing down? Oh my god, slow the hell down. <laughs> Jeez. Ugh. Poor ship design. Oh my god, it's almost like I built this thing. Ugh. Oh, 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 geez. I don't think I can recall that. Couldn't really get much closer on that one. Whew. All right, I'll back in a sec.
Okie dokie. Now that all of that is finally finished with, and yes, I decided to do a random... I'm not going for you. I did do a random uh, time lapse. I don't know why. I just felt like doing it, so I did. But um, now that that's all done with, I do think I lost a little bit of resources from that Alcash because the cargo container filled up and I didn't really realize it. I mean, oh well. <laughs> It is what it is. It's not a big deal. I mean, like, I, I can't complain. Like, look, we got 19,000 uh, steel plate there. Like, another 50,000 there. Like, we're, we're good, right? Another 40. Like, we're, we're fine, okay? We're fine for resources. I can afford to lose a little bit like that. <clears throat> anyway, so what I thought we'd do now is several things. First, I want to put those hydrogen tanks down over there just so I can get the layout organized for these things so I'm thinking that the hydrogen tanks should be like no should we have them on the ground like so no why did you do this oh freaking T is on go away why is T even a thing who uses it? I'm curious. Does anyone use the um, auto rotate thing and use it su successfully? Because I've never been able to. It never does what I want it to do. Okay, so we're going to have tanks like that. One, two, three, four. Can we get a sneak a fifth one in? We can. Excellent. So we'll have like five tanks like that over there. I think that'll look good. Now we need oxygen tanks as well. Because how else are you supposed to breathe? Yeah, I'm thinking oxygen tanks. How do we want to do the oxygen tanks? Do you just want like a little cluster of four over here? I think that's what we want. Just four. Bam, 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 bam. Yeah. I think that's good. Speaking of oxygen. Oh no. Alright, I'm out. Oxygen. I need oxygen. Close the door. Close. Go in here. <sighs> Much better. I can breathe now. Let's just quickly heal everything up while we're here. I still haven't got a proper med bay. That's a little bit of an issue, but luckily that's one that should be solved soon. There we go, that's good enough. All right, let's close this door up so I don't waste what little precious oxygen is left in this ship. He says that as he opens it. Come on, open. There we go. Yeah, so I think, I think that's gonna be a little hydrogen tank facility. Now, over here is where we wanted to build our um, little, uh, what would you call it? Like a pod, survival pod thing. So I'm thinking we're gonna make it about yay big. Yeah, yeah about that big for now. Because we're gonna leave all this area open up for further storage, because <laughs> clearly we're gonna need it. Clearly storage is going to be a bit of an issue um, in this world. So I'm just going to quickly lay out a just a basic square framework. Okay, I think I left a gap there for a door, which is not intent was not my intention, but it works out like that anyway. I've got to world you. There we go. Let's go like that. Okay, so that's going to be our first little survival pod okay now what do we want in here we're thinking we're thinking we're gonna have a couple little rooms so there'll be like one room here maybe this will be like a little shower room this will be a bedroom like that then we'll have like a mirror diversion over here how big would I make it? Was it 2 by 3 It was 2 by 3 Okay, sweet. So, 1, 2, then, then, bam, bam, bam. Like that. This will be like another shower room. And then in here, I'm thinking, let's get some DLC blocks up. Decorative blocks. Um, not you guys. So, that's the armory. We're going to need one of these. We're going to need some planters, because that's also where the kitchen is. We're going to need some chairs. All right, and we're going to need a toilet, because you're going to have toilet. Okay, so 
We have the toilet there. And a shower there. I think that'll work well. Do the same over here, but the other way. Like that. Okay, now I'll just chuck these here. Awesome. Then we're gonna go have like a plant here, and another plant over here. And then of course we're gonna have our little lounge area. Boom. 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 And then we might put like a TV here or something for them to watch. Yeah. We do like that a big lounge area and then a TV here for them to watch. Sure, why not? Because it's cool. <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying. Okay, so I got that now. Where's the bed? It's here. Yep, okay, bed. Now, the bed we can kind of actually sneak a bed into the wall. I like how they've done that. So, bam, got that there. We'll have a window out. Do the same thing over here. Like that. Alright. Then, what we might also do is we might put like a cargo container here as well in the wall and do some little decorative stuff. What we're going to want, you're going to want a plant, sure. Then, you probably want your own private little couch. That's not the. Thing. I don't know if what that was. Um, there. Then we're going to need a desk, aren't we? Okay, so give me the desks. Uh, I wish they had like a desk with a computer on it. That would be cool. But there we go. Put a desk there. There you go. Private little quarters. What do you think? I think that looks cool. I think it's going to be great. Um, now, with this entranceway. I'm thinking the armory should be here. I'll have like one on that side and one on that side. And then... Uh, maybe we'll just do a little bit of decorative building here. Like so. And then we're going to have the door. The sliding doors. One there and one there. It's like a little airlock. I think that'll work well. I hope that works well. But yeah, there we go. Nice little airlock. Everything should be nice and tight and secure. Excellent. Alrighty, so I'm just going to quickly weld all of this up. Alright, well I've got most of it welded up. Actually, I think I've got it all welded up. Except I haven't finished off this room, but I'll get to it. That's on the list. That's on the list of things to do. So, what I'm thinking is... we. I should make, uh, no, that's not what I want. I want that like that, okay. So what I'm thinking is we're going to have, like, this come, this kind of pat and wrap around this building, like so. Um, like this. Bam, bam. And then, of course, we're just going to leave a gap there for the window. Because why the hell not? People need to see out. You know, makes them feel like they're still a human. Some sort of connection to the real world, you know, all that jazz. Thing like this, boom, boom, boom. Like that. And then we're gonna put this like so. Okay, so we're gonna do that. I think that's gonna be the way we're gonna do this section. Now, how was I gonna do this? Because I don't really wanna I don't wanna do that. But if I do that Mm, okay, maybe what we might have to do, actually let's change this up a little bit, give me all of this, um, 11, there we go, bam, Oi. okay, now, so how are we going to do this, we're going to do like that, yeah, and then bam, 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 yeah, so we're going to do that, we're going to wrap around, like so, with this, Design all the way around and then in on the top I think we're just gonna do flat flat little roof just a tiny little hidden away compartment type thing Nothing too big or flash or fancy. We've got our vent connected at the back there So we don't have to worry about that. 
So that's going to be our basic design for this guy. So what I should do now is get it finished off so we can see what it looks like. Yeah, a nice little module. I kind of like it actually. It's kind of like sleek and hidden. Are you ready for the big reveal? And here it is. Oh, went too far. The Habitat Dome. Kind of cool. It's nice and sleek. It's not too obtrusive. I like it. I like the entrance. It's got windows that you can see into. If you come in here, this would be like the airlock. You get your little space suits on each side and your guns and stuff like that. Beam, nice and closed. We come in here. We've got an LCD panel, which I forgot to build. Oh, well, it is what it is. Got the couches. Then you come in here. You've got the little thing. Little secret storage section, because why the hell not? But yeah, I think it's quite nice. It came out quite well. I like it. You get the little bed here. You can look at that window. You know, you got the TV there with its back turned to you. It's just, it's good. It's nice. I like it. Kitchen. We've got some kitchen, some random storage, dining table. You know, I think it came out pretty well. What do you guys think? I, I I'm quite happy with it. But you know what? That's going to be it for this episode, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did enjoy it, why not leave it a like, comment, subscribe, all that other stuff. And as always, have a good one, and I'll see you all next time. How have you got oxygen? Is there, is there oxygen in here, or are you just saying you're ready? There is no oxygen in here. You're just saying you're good to go. Yes, thank you for telling me. <laughs> <laughs> Big confusion. Uh, yeah, blah, blah, blah. Have a good one, as always. And I'll see you all next time. Bye. I don't know. I, I completely buggered out that outro. Wait a minute. What if I did this? Oh, that might look cool. That kind of looks cool. Last minute adjustment. But yeah, there you go. Final thing. we got to paint all this stuff soon, too.